Hi there. PJ back in his toy cave with a recent find that I got at a, a toy convention in February here in Montreal. It was one of the best shows I've ever did in 15 years. Profitable and finding a lot of pieces. Today's review is called Galact Galactic Star Mates. M-I-T-E-S. Diecast Metal Movable Action Parts. Valcon 1. V-A-L-C-A-N. Yeah, Valcan 1. Uh, reminds me of something out of um, Goldorak. It's metal, it's metal on top of plastic. Uh, if you could see closely, the two little hands are different red. This is more of a crimson red, this is more of a cherry red. Comes with two weapons that you could change the hands. You push the little button on the, on, on the arm and it goes flying. Uh, the packaging is dead mint. I got it off a friend of mine. Emperor Toy Kids em Emperor Toys Kids Love. This came out in 1970. Number 0966, made in Hong Kong. See bottom of box for instructions. Bottom of box for instructions. There you go. How to play with Valcon 1. When the when this button is pressed, arm shoots out. Caution, be careful not to have your face in front of the launcher when you set uh, the missiles, when you set the missiles at it. When you set the missiles at it, okay. Also be careful not to shoot the missiles to another person's face. Non-toxic finish. Front. One side view. The other side view. Underneath uh, the, the top here, see? There's a little, it's really it's hard to see, but I hope you could see that, guys. There. And the back view. The back view, there's different, oops, there's different things in the back. There is a dozer, barricade, commander shovel, battle, blue silver, rocket cutter, uh, brain three, jack. Geek, Jeet, Jeet, Jack, Get, Jack, Toner, and Power Crane, uh, cr cr Power Craner. But the one I really like is the robot. The robot itself, Valcon One, is freaking awesome. Uh, the condition of this is, I would say, between C9 and a 10. It's dead mint. I didn't pay much for it. I paid forty dollars for a friend of mine at a convention. I love it. I give it. A 5 out of 5. It's a rare piece. I've seen a lot going on the internet go between 40 to uh, between $90. Uh, it's not rare meaning that it's expensive in price. It's very affordable. It's very easy. You can find it right now on eBay. Love it. I'm going to put it with my, my collection of uh, Shogun Warriors. This is what it reminds me of. The small Shogun Warriors or Gordorak. Grandizer, sorry in English and uh, go that I can in French or Japanese um, I could be wrong with Japanese for it uh, this is something that it's never gonna leave my collection I don't care if it's worth uh, thousands of dollars it's something that I like when I showed it to the Godfather he loved it and he he wanted to go and see if my friend had more but they were all sold he bought three of them and he sold them all plus a junkie out thank you for watching this short video I hope you enjoy it and stay plastic